Multiple Intelligences Some Information Interview with Dr. John S. Norman Last month, Y. Bright interviewed psychologist Dr. John S. Norman, 48. We asked him to explain the educational theory of multiple intelligences. The theory was first developed in 1983 by Howard Gardner. an American psychologist and professor of neuroscience from Harvard University in the United States. Dr. Norman, how many kinds of intelligence are there according to Dr. Gardner? There are eight kinds of intelligence, that is, linguistic, logical-mathematical, visual-spatial, bodily kinesthetic, musical, interpersonal, intrapersonal, and naturalist. However, they don't operate independently. They are used at the same time and complement each other. What is the characteristic of linguistic intelligence? People with linguistic intelligence are good with words and language. They often become teachers, writers, poets, lawyers, or journalists. What about logical mathematical intelligence? People that deal with numbers and complex mathematical operations have this type of intelligence. Engineers, scientists, mathematicians, and computer programmers are good examples of people with logical mathematical intelligence. What kinds of people have bodily kinesthetic intelligence? People with good physical coordination, such as actors, dancers, athletes, pilots, surgeons, builders, and soldiers. What about musical intelligence? We see this in musicians, conductors, and composers. These people are able to think in a musical way and are sensitive to melody and rhythm. Is visual-spatial intelligence common among architects and sculptors? Yes, it is. It is also common among pilots, painters, sailors, and chess players. These people can represent the spatial world internally in their mind and can visualize images in three dimensions. What type of people have strong interpersonal intelligence? Extroverts, such as salespeople, educators, managers, and religious and political leaders. They have an easy time interacting with others. What about interpersonal intelligence? People with this kind of intelligence are introspective, understand themselves, know who they are and what they can do. A philosopher is a good example of somebody with intrapersonal intelligence. And what are the characteristics of naturalist intelligence? Observation of nature and the understanding of natural systems, for example, plants and animals. This kind of intelligence is common among ecologists and botanists. Why is the theory of multiple intelligence important for students? It is important for students because it helps them to identify their strong and weak points and to find the career that would be best for them.